cross dominance, so thank you for this. Cross dominance, this is rare. A lot of people think they're ambidextrous or cross dominant. Really, they're somewhat dyspraxic. They actually lack coordination and did not be very good at sports or physical movement because their brain never picked one side to get very good at. Unfortunately, you get a lot of kids being like, I'm ambidextrous. And really, their handwriting is really not the best. And they've never really done well at physical activities. They think they're ambidextrous because both sides kind of are awkward. But cross dominant is actually a thing. This is when your body has picked different activities for different sides of your body. I am very slightly cross dominant. To be cross dominant and actually consider yourself cross dominant, you need to be fairly coordinated. A little bit of a self call, right? But for example, somebody cross dominant might be very good at catching and throwing things on their right side, but very good at things like flexibility on their left. If you can believe it, people that are actually heavily cross dominant tend to actually be better at sports, things like hockey and baseball. But again, it's more rare than you think. Most people that refer to themselves as cross dominant, not saying you, but most people that say I'm both handed or ambidextrous tend to actually be lacking coordination and could benefit from something called occupational therapy. For the few people that are actually cross dominant, they tend to be extremely good at sports and sometimes elite athletes. I hope this helps.